The FAA expects more than 50,000 flights today, many of those travelers flying to a destination for a perfect view of the solar eclipse. Fox's Chelsea Torres is live at Philadelphia International Airport tonight. And Chelsea, the FAA says there could be airport impacts from this. What do we know about that? Yeah, Christine, you know, a lot of the airports that I've talked to that are in this line of totality, they really tell me business will be as usual, but they're warning passengers to make sure they give themselves some extra time so they can catch their flight. But it's really the air traffic control centers, the ones that are monitoring those planes, that say on Monday they expect to see heavy air traffic. Now, the FAA warns there might be higher traffic volume at airports along the path of the eclipse, and people should plan for the possibility of flight delays. Delays. These airports include San Antonio, Austin, Dallas, Indianapolis, Cleveland, and even Buffalo. Some airlines like Southwest and Delta are offering special flights for travelers to see the eclipse from the sky. And aside from commercial flights, FlightAware tells me on Monday they expect thousands of small private planes also trying to get a close-up view. People traveling ahead of the eclipse today say they are ready to deal with those big crowds. But one thing we are worried about is that there's going to be so much traffic on the roads. And so to drive a long way may, may be problematic. But we're, we're going to play it by ear. And we're also, I'm also a little concerned about the weather, that it might be cloudy, in which case, <laughs> I'm not sure what we'll do. But <laughs> And Hertz does say that if you are planning on renting a car this weekend ahead of the eclipse, just know that their advanced bookings have already hit over 3,000 times more compared to this time last year. In Philadelphia, Chelsea Torres, Fox 5 News. Wow. All right, Chelsea, thanks. Just a reminder, eyewear company Warby Parker has once again offered free solar eclipse glasses at its stores. Customers can pick up ISO certified solar eclipse glasses. Each family can receive two pairs until the eclipse day, which is Monday, or while supplies last. The company did a similar giveaway back in 2017. All right, so the next total solar eclipse when the moon comes between us and the sun is happening this Monday. We have a full eclipse 2024 guide with what you need to know if you're in Metro Atlanta. Head to our website, fox5atlanta.com or the Fox 5 Atlanta app.